Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Summer and I've got another haul video to share with you guys. I have another order from Scoopable Wax Melts and this was her Christmas in July pre-order and I feel like I just ordered it a few weeks ago. Here is the card that comes with it and Kathy and Tim must have been really busy because I feel like it's still July and it was a pre-order and I already have my order. So, this was kind of a smaller order. I ordered three loaves from the Christmas in July pre-order, and then I ordered another three cake sampler. And so, it's all the same scents that I shared before on my video. So, if you guys haven't checked out that video, I will try my best to link it up here. And um, you can watch that and see all the yummy scents that were in that three cake sampler. And then I also got a mystery box. So she had, I think this was $49. And it was like, I think she said five pounds of wax. I can't remember. I will put it in the description box down below, all the information. But um, I haven't looked through it or anything. So it's going to be a surprise for all of us on camera today. So let's get into my order. The first thing here, I got a loaf of Yoshi the Red Nose Dino. Raspberry sauce, pistachio, and marshmallow fluff. And I want to say I've had this before, maybe from Rose Girls, or maybe from Kathy at Scoopable. But it's so good. I was kind of worried about the raspberry and the pistachio, but they actually mix really nice. And I really like their raspberry sauce. I've heard good things about it. Lots of people rave about it, and I can see why it's so good. This is really, really pretty. It's just like a pistachio. It's like a really sweet, nutty with a little bit of the marshmallow fluff and it smells so good if you like pistachio and raspberry. Next, I got Santa's Bakery, pie crust, vanilla butter fudge, and vanilla bean Noel type. Smells good. You really get that pie crust in this one and the vanilla butter fudge. I don't get a lot of vanilla bean Noel, but I'm sure it'll come out more on warm. It's kind of a lighter scent because it is vanilla based and pie crust isn't one of those like really heavy scents either, but it smells really good. This will be good on its own or even blended with something else. And then the last loaf I got, and I should say, these say that they're 14 ounces. And I think she calls these no frills just because there's nothing on them. They're just straight pour, which I don't mind that at all. I mean, we're just going to be chopping it up and melting it, right? So, I actually kind of like them because they're less messy. The last loaf I have is Christmas Eve in Cookie Land. And this is a repurchase. I really love this scent. Eggnog, Royal Sugar Cookie, Monster Cookie, Marshmallow Smoothie, Donut Holes, and then Cookie Land which is, I forgot the notes of Cookie Land, but I'll put them here on the screen. Oh my gosh, this is so good. It's like, and her eggnog isn't like sour or really milky or anything. It's really nice. It's just kind of a slightly spicy bakery. And it's perfect. I want to say Cookie Land has like, butterscotch pretzels or toffee. I'll put the notes on the screen so you can see, but this is just a really, really pretty bakery with eggnog. Okay, and now let's get into the mystery box. I'm so excited. I really love mystery boxes. I know they're not for everyone, but I'm kind of open to just trying anything, and I like a lot of different categories, even though y'all know I'm a bakery girl at heart. Um, I've really gotten into like fresh aquatic scents. I've really gotten into more earthy, woody scents. And so it was a great deal. And I just wanted to see what she offered because I've never ordered a mystery box from Scoopable Wax. So all the Scoopable ones were wrapped in tissue paper, but I unwrapped them just for convenience for this video. So I'm going to take everything out. And then as I smell it, I'm going to put it back in this box. There is a lot of wax here. Wow. Okay. So the first thing I got a loaf, which, wow, that's amazing. This is in Hello Lemon Sugar Type. Sweet sugar cane with notes of lemon rind and shortbread. 
That's interesting. I don't know that I've ever heard of this blend. Wow. Okay. That is a that is a lemon rind. That's crazy. It's not like super tart, but it's like the rind. You can definitely tell the difference. But it's not a bakery lemon. It's lemon rind. Wow. I actually like this a lot more than I thought. And then I'm sure the sweet sugar cane kind of tones down maybe the tartness. I'm really excited to melt this. I thought it was going to maybe give me like lemon pound cake vibes, but it doesn't. It's, it's like a sweet lemon with a hint of bakery. It's, it's so different and unique. So kind of excited to try this out. And I have a loaf, so hopefully I'll like it. If not, I can pass it on. Okay. Next, I got a chunk pot pie, which I love these. I think they're so cute. This is Alice in Slumberland, honeydew, sweet lavender, and cotton candy frosting. I don't think I've ever tried this, but I've always kind of wanted to. Oh, wow. This is really fun. So, yeah, I get all the notes. Cotton candy, lavender, and honeydew. But honestly... I was like, there is no way that this is going to work. It's going to smell super funky, but it really does. Their lavender is really good. And the honeydew, I'm loving it. That smells really nice. I may melt this in my room for like my lavender nighttime scent. Really, really fun blend. I like that a lot. Next, I got a chunk wax cookie, which I don't think I've ever seen these before. Maybe I have, but if I have, it's been a while. Apples and peach royal cookie. Spicy apples and peaches and royal sugar cookie. I am not the biggest fan of peach. But since this is bakery and I love royal sugar cookie, we will see. I definitely smell the peach, but it says spicy apples and peaches. So it's almost like peach pie like the peaches like in that in the glaze and like for a peach pie filling with spicy apples kind of like an apple pie is what it smells like it's kind of just a hint of peach it's like a sweetened spicy apple I don't mind this this is like perfect for fall I'm gonna melt this and see how I feel about it Next, I got raspberry orange sherbet. This is raspberry sauce and orange sherbet. I've never really smelled orange sherbet in wax, but I really like their raspberry sauce. This is different. It's the orange sherbet kind of smells like an orange dreamsicle. And I don't get a whole ton of the raspberry sauce. It's different. It's not my favorite, but I may try it and see. Orange, like, bakery just doesn't appeal to me. I want to like it so much, and it's just not my favorite. But, I mean, you know, to each their own, right? Next, I got an ice cream scoop in Fraser Fir. The cozy and comforting scent of a fresh Fraser Fir tree at Christmas time. I really like tree scents. And this is such a good one. It's just pure tree, but really nice. It's so good. We don't do a live Christmas tree. We do a artificial one, so I like to melt tree scents at Christmas. Next, I got frosted three cakes. This is one of the items in the sampler, so I'm so excited to have another one of these because I loved this one. Yellow cake, birthday cake, cream cheese frosting, and cupcakes at Tiffany's. It's a cute little acorn shape. Oh my gosh, it's just a really nice creamy cakey bakery. Gosh, that three cake sampler was like one of my favorites. So good, so excited to have more of those blends. I got another ice cream scoop, wax melt, and coffee bean express. Coffee bean, marshmallow, and monster cookie. Oh wow, that's really nice. 
perfect for my Tuesday morning. That coffee bean will just wake you right up. Mm. I'm gonna mix with cookies and marshmallows. Like, yes, so good. Next, I got Sweet Lavender Orange Sherbet Shaving Cream Overpour. I don't really know how I feel about shaving cream. I feel like I like it in some blends and in some blends I don't. I don't mind the orange sherbet in this one as much because it feel like it's drowned out more by the shaving cream and lavender. It's kind of like a lavender minty smell. Maybe a hint of the orange, but I really like this. I wasn't, I didn't think I was going to. So yeah, this is nice. Next, I got a chunk wax cookie and monster bread, wild berry monster cookie and baked zucchini bread. I feel like this like is perfect for me. I couldn't have handpicked better scents if I wanted to. Oh man, I wanna say, did I get monster bread and like on pie day when she did the pies? This smells very familiar to me. I love this. That baked zucchini bread just really stands out to me and it smells divine. And the wild berry and monster cookie. This is a top tier blend. I love this. Next, I got a wax bunt cake. I don't think I've ever seen this shape from her shop. This is rosemary, lavender, vanilla, rosemary, mint type, and lavender, vanilla type. Oh, this is different. I like the rosemary mint with the lavender. This smells really good. This will be another nighttime blend. I might do this in my kid's room for sleep. It's really pretty and calming. Next, I got an ice cream scoop melt in raspberry rainbow. Raspberry, fresh squeezed oranges, strawberries, and bananas. It's different. Don't really care for banana, but... And that's literally like the first thing I smell. I feel like if you don't like certain scents and they have them in blends, a lot of times it's like the only thing you can smell because you don't care for it. It's very fruity, but I get the banana first. Maybe a little bit of orange. But it's like strawberry banana. It's not my favorite, but you know, it's not terrible either. And of course, it's a mystery, so you're not gonna like everything. Okay, next I got another Frosted Three Cakes. I'm so excited. Yellow Cake, Birthday Cake, Cream Cheese Frosting, and Cupcakes at Tiffany's. This one's in a cute leaf shape. So glad to have another one of those. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I did not see this. Okay, this is uh, some Wax Heart Melts and Sea Salt Lavender Breeze, which is like one of my top blends from Kathy. Summer days spent by the sea with a soft lavender breeze. Oh my gosh, I'm thrilled to have more of this. It is just, oh my gosh, like so good. Another one of those like really surprising blends to me. Like this sounds good, right? Like sea salt lavender breeze. Yeah, it sounds nice, but it is just, phenomenal especially for me somebody that this is not my typical it's not in my typical wheelhouse it's not bakery it's lavender and aquatic like really this blend is is just it's perfection i'm so excited to have more and it smells really good on cold but i'm telling you like it performed in my bedroom for like three days and i never turned my warmer off it was just really good performer Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. And then I got five scoopables. That was a lot of wax. Okay. The first scoopable is Kaylin's Scotcheroos, a secret bakery blend. Hmm. I love bakery blends. This smells good. This is like one of those, it's like a butterscotch toffee caramel, like one of those warmer bakery scents to me. That's what I'm getting. It smells really good. Be a good like fall bakery. Oh, what am I smelling? Brown sugar maybe? It smells really good. It's just a warmer bakery. 
Next, I got Spearmint, a very refreshing and energizing minty aroma. Now, I'm not the biggest fan of Spearmint, like gum and things like that, but I don't know that I've ever tried it in wax. It smells literally just like Spearmint gum. This isn't my favorite thing in the whole wide world, so I may de-stash it. Or if I find someone like a friend or a family member that wants it, I can just give it to them. Okay, next I got Christmas Past. Ah, the scent we will look forward to all year long. The ambrosial, woodsy pine pleasure of the Christmas tree. This heartwarming scent beautifully sparks your memories of past Christmas holidays and ignites excitement for the future one on its way. Whew, that was a mouthful. So I guess it's just like Christmas tree. Oh, it's pretty. It does smell like Christmas. It's like pine, maybe like berry, cranberry maybe. A little bit of cinnamon. It literally just smells like your house at Christmas. It smells really good. I love that. Next, I got sugared strawberry cookies. I think I got a different form of this recently, maybe. Did I get a loaf? I don't remember, but I really love this blend. Freshly baked gourmet strawberry cookies, creamy whipped frosting, sprinkled with sweet notes of sugar. Yeah, it's really sweet strawberry bakery. So good. I love strawberry bakery. Gosh, this mystery box was like a win. And then the last one, oh yay, I got another Yoshi the Red Nose Dino. Raspberry sauce, pistachio, and marshmallow fluff. Same as what I got a loaf in. Ooh, I feel like I get more of the pistachio in the scoopable. I get the raspberry, but I feel like the pistachio is what I get the most. It smells so good. Wow, that mystery box was really good. I would definitely get another one in the future. That's everything I got from Scoopable Wax Melts. I also have a really, really small fantasy wax haul that I'm just going to throw in here because it's just like three different scents. So since it's small, I thought I could just put it with this and do a combined haul. So this first thing I got was a sample in Gourmet Sugar Cookie. This is so good. I hope Kirsten brings it to her shop soon. And then I got three different scents from the Barbie release. I wasn't going to participate, but I just had to get this one scent that I got three of. So I got three of these like mini cubes. I can't remember what she calls them. But this was in the scent The Dream House. Strawberry bread, French baguette, and zucchini bread. Look at the labels. If you can see that, they are so cute for the Barbie release. So strawberry bready, I mean, this is just like, say less. This is me if there ever was a me scent. Strawberry bread, French baguette, and zucchini bread. And this is just, three is not enough. So good. Like, perfection. I can't wait to melt it. I also got life in plastic, pink lemonade, and strawberry white cake. I'm trying to experiment with, like, lemonades. And I think strawberry and lemonade go well together. And I love strawberry white cake, but this is just like super lemonade -y. Oh, well, I take that back. I get more of the strawberry white cake on the back. So yeah, I'm excited to melt that and see how it goes. But yeah, that's a pretty good combo. And then lastly, I got a bunt in high Barbie, pink frosted cake and jelly donut. Really love jelly donut scents. It's like a rich cake mixed with a jelly donut. I get the cake note the most. Hopefully the jelly donut note will come out more on warm. So that was everything from my small order from Fantasy Wax. And that is everything I have for this haul. So let me know if you participated in either one of these. Did you participate in Scoopables Christmas in July pre-order? Or did you participate in Fantasy Wax Melt's Barbie release? please let me know down below. And if you did, let me know what some of the things you got were and which were your favorites. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have a wonderful day, week, or weekend, and I'll see you all in my next video very soon. Bye.